Hello, our Septosauri. I'm Septa. I'm Sore, and this is us. And today we're checking out DPR Ian, No Blueberries, featuring DPR Live and CL. CL. I think it might be names of other people. Yeah, I don't I don't know what's going on. <laughs> <I don't either. laughs> to be honest. Um, we had a lot of people actually suggest DPR to us and a mainly no blueberries. So <laughs> everybody yeah, seems to think out. that we're really gonna like this, and I'm excited to see it. Yeah, so we did check out the lyrics and it kind of makes me feel like he's talking about toxic relationship that's unpredictable. And I feel like he feels like he's hostage in the relationship almost. Yeah. Is what it seems like. Yeah. And because I feel like because uh, he says, um, I don't like blueberries in my ice cream cake is like one of the first lines, you know, give or take maybe a few words. But that's basically the way he's saying. And so we were talking and it'd be like. She is my ice cream cake. And then uh, once in a while, if I take a bite, there might be some blueberries in there, which would be like uh, maybe she's having a bad day or something. So like she says something a little snarky. Uh, Maybe that was a sour blueberry. A sour blueberry, right? Where it's like, you know, you love this thing so much, but then sometimes uh, you just have like. A, a bit of a bad experience that would never happen i love her she's perfect uh but you know I'm, we're just you know like hypothetically speaking <laughs> of course <laughs> right <laughs> um so i'm curious if like if if we're right about that where yeah he's like in this toxic relationship but he can't leave it because there's so much good or that he sees as good um and, but like that so he feels like a prisoner in it yeah and like there's so much sweetness, but then also maybe too much sweetness sometimes. Yeah. And another interpretation could be maybe he just doesn't like blueberries. And yeah. like obviously blue contents with like sadness. So maybe each bite of a blueberry is Mix- like his mixing sadness. sadness in with all of that. Yeah, sure. Maybe. Yeah. I'm curious what they're going to try to portray in this video. Me too. And I am really curious what this sound is going to be like. I know just from reading the lyrics that there's at least one rap section, but I don't know what the rest of it's going to sound like at all. Like sonically, I am going in blind here. Really interested though. Did he have an eyeball ring? Yes, he did. Nice. Okay, I did notice that correctly then. Undercover. Can't read the rest. Thank you. These upside down backwards. Yeah. some blueberries that just kind of looked like blueberry ice cream yeah it did (laughs) just gonna flick all the blueberries I see That would be terrifying. Yeah, I'd be unsettled. Call it a day. <laughs> Time to go home. <laughs> oh, okay. Ooh. I like no blueberries in my ice cream cake. No air to breathe with that masking tape. Stop, please. I need a hostage free. I need a rocket ship. I need a run from. I like no blueberries in my ice cream. Oh, trippy. No air to breathe with that masking tape. Stop, please. I need a hostage free. I need a rocket ship. I need a run from. I like no blueberries in my ice cream. I need a run from. I like no blueberries in my ice cream. I need a
with the really cool. Oh. Son, I'm stylish. She's the wiggy. I'm a vibey villain. Me, I'm more. Yeah, oh, she knows it. She's in love with me, and that's a drug and dangerous doses. In love with your poses. Can't see straight, can't focus. Get chills when I see your old face. She's the coldest. 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 I like no blueberries in my ice cream cake. No air to breathe with that masking tape. Stop me. I need a hostage free. I need a rocket ship. I need a run. All right, I think I know exactly what this is about. I think it was easier than what we were trying to go for, all right? I think the ultimate message is you get what you get and you don't throw a fit. You know what? I like that. I, I think like that's that all message. it was. That's all. <laughs> if, you, if you throw a fit, you're going to be hunted down by a slender man looking guy and you'll get murdered. Yeah. Okay, so stop. Kids, please. Okay, just eat, eat <laughs> what's in front of you. Don't complain. All right? Thank the chef. You're getting dessert. <laughs> just say thank you. Just say thank you. Okay. Eat what's in front of you. <laughs> yeah, exactly. And don't make a mess for the staff. Okay? Yeah. That's disrespectful. That's very rude, actually. Yeah, I know. After yourself. I know. So whatever souls are left in that diner, it's probably they like- playing. It's probably like a cook that worked there their whole life you mm-hmm. know mm-hmm. or maybe even like a waitress that mm-hmm. just worked there her whole life saw him and like she saw flicking, him those, flicking off. those the disrespect was like, nah and they ain't playing with that I'm teaching you a lesson today <laughs> we'll play here <laughs> at the devil's diner all right you don't it's called the devil's diner for a reason <laughs> please i agree i believe he was taught a lesson <laughs> I, I would learn jesus <laughs> like oh no i love blueberries I love him so much. <laughs> Please. Uh, I really liked that song, though, actually. Me too. It was really groovy. It was chill, man. Super chill. I liked his voice, too. It was a very relaxing voice. I was going to say, I really, really enjoyed his tone. Mm-hmm. It was really clear. It was. Yeah, it was really nice. Yes. Easy on the ears. Yeah, I want to hear more. If you guys have more suggestions that you think that we would like, drop it in the comments. I want to know. I need to know. Yeah. I want to hear more. I'm definitely putting this on uh, on a playlist because I really liked it. And also the rap, the rapper. Yeah. Uh, I really enjoyed him too. Me too. I was scared it was going to ruin the flow. Me too. But man, they did a great job at putting that in there and finding like a solid flow for it that fits really nicely with the song. Yeah. And I really enjoyed the visual effects that they used. They didn't go too crazy with it. They did a lot of color contrast and then some warping effects. 
yeah. on the image to make something that if you just showed it normally, it wouldn't be that unsettling. Right. Like you got some glimpses of like what that mask looked like. And then they like warped it to make it look creepier. And then they like moved around the eyeball on his ring and stuff. Uh, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> and then, me out a little bit there. Yeah. And then they added like the glowing eyes and stuff. And then they made the rapper guy's sunglasses all like neon. Yeah. And stuff. And that some was cool, cool little like flares. Yeah. It was little touches that I think were perfect. Nothing seemed like crazy overboard, but I was interested. The entire time. Yeah, I was too. Yeah. I'm going to have to really watch it good. again too because I feel like there's some like some things that I might have missed, missed out. Just admiring some of the shots and, yeah. and like the earrings and stuff like that distracted me so much because <laughs> I just think earrings are really cool. So uh, I would we definitely need to rewatch this. And I'm seeing like I'm seeing a thumbnail with uh dpr ian I'm, pretty, I'm hoping that's how you say that and it's got his eyeball ring in it so is this a story a storyline story because if it is i love me some storylines i need the order <laughs> yeah we need another order so that we can see because if there's more to like the lore of like this creature that's coming after him and kind of what's going on i would love to know it because i'm very intrigued at what they got what they're Me building too. together, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, I love when they do storyline music videos. Yeah. It's yeah, it's fun. one of my favorite things. It's just, yeah, it's cool. It's fun to see kind of like what they're trying to portray and what they're trying to tell and how they go about that. Exactly. Yeah. Uh, overall, I really liked it, though. I, I really enjoyed it. So groovy. Chill. And I kind of liked it. It was like kind of laid back, but still had like a good beat and stuff to it. And I liked his voice and the rapper's voice and... The rappers flow a lot. So, yeah, I would say that I really enjoyed this song. You guys were right. <laughs> we do really good like job. it. Yeah, good job, guys. Yeah, I, I want to hear more and I want to see the whole storyline. Yeah, if there is one. I think there is. I think there is too. Let's go. <laughs> Make our dreams come true. <laughs> yeah, so let us know in the comments if there is a storyline. If there is, tell us what order it needs to go. And if there's not, then just tell us what we need to watch next um, because I want to check out more. Same. <laughs> if you made this far, please consider like and subscribe, maybe hit that bell. We have tons of other reactions if you want to go watch those. We also have a Patreon if you want to support us over there. And we have another channel called Septa and Soar where we could talk about kind of whatever we want. Uh, the link for that will be in the description below. Until next time. Always remember that we love you. Stay safe and healthy, and we'll see you in the next video. Bye, Septasauri. Bye.